Hi there, Edu Prado here, and today I'm gonna to tell you about how I sampled this pipe organ. So let's get into it. Welcome to Christ Church Rathgar. It's a Presbyterian church in the heart of Rathgar in the south side of Dublin. And they are very active in the community and very open to different music projects. And they're also the home of this beautiful 19th century pipe organ. This church was founded in 1859. And the first organ was built around 1899. So it's over 100 years old and it was rebuilt in 1959, going through many renovations throughout its life. And during the worldwide pandemic in 2020, unfortunately the church had to close its doors for quite a few months. And that's when actually we decided to get in touch with the church and propose to, to do a project using the organ to bring some music and life back into the church. So from this project, we created the Rathgar Pipe Organ Simple Library for Context, but also the album called Irish Pipes Through Time, where with the composer collective Sony Gate Studios, we composed five pieces for pipe organ and cello, and we had the brilliant participation of the cello player, Kate Ellis. What I love about the pipe organ is that it always provides this experience that's deeply connected to the space where it's in. Because you can't really take a pipe organ somewhere else. So you usually go to the hall or to the church to experience the music. And that's the whole idea what we really try to capture here, to make the sound as natural as possible and keep all the character and all the imperfections of the organ in the hall that makes it very unique. So for that, I invited a friend of mine that is an organist and we played around with the organ throughout the day to find the best sounds for this instrument in this hall. So instead of deep sampling each one of the stops separately and, and mixing them back in, in, in contact or in the DAW, we decided to actually find the best combination of stops and recorded a lot of presets that just sound amazing. And then we really have the whole acoustic interactions of the sound in the room. So for the recording, we used two stereo pairs of microphones. One closed position, which was a pair of Neumann's KM-184s. And in the back of the hall for the far microphones, we used a pair of DPA's 4006s. They are sounding fantastic. And what's great in the instrument is that you have the option to use one mic or the other, or blend them in as you want to really get the sound you're looking for. So there's a lot of sonic possibilities here as well. A great surprise we had when sampling this organ is the sound of the hall. Because the church is not that big and has like lovely wooden ceilings and carpet on the floor. And that actually provides a very rich and warm organ sound with a lot of presence and control to the sound, which you usually wouldn't expect for a pipe organ. And the result is pretty amazing. So if you want to learn more about the instrument, I made a walkthrough video where I show all the controls and the interface and how it works. And there's also a video where I play through all the presets so you can hear how it sounds. And I really hope you get to love this instrument as much as I do. The whole experience of creating the Rathgar pipe organ was amazing and I'm thrilled to finally share that with everyone. So please let me know what you think. Thanks so much for watching and I see you on the next one.